into a tech vlog. So today we're gonna be heading to Best Buy to check out as much tech as possible. This definitely includes multiple digital cameras and even the iMac Pro and maybe even more. So guys, I am so excited to head there. So without further ado, let's go. Alright, so we are now coming down to the digital camera aisle. Now, something that I can see straight off the bat is that these are very expensive. Some things can even go for as high as, you know, like 500 bucks, you know, 400 bucks. These are very expensive. Down here, we have something close to $1,000 for a small little camera like that. So, these are definitely not cheap at all. Now, the cameras that I'm really focused in on getting are these. These are handy cams, and I do like the feel of them. They feel great in the hand, and something that I do like is that they do have the flip out screen so I can use them as a viewfinder while I am recording. So these are definitely the things that I do want to buy. All right. So coming around the corner here, now this is basically the next best thing to the iMac Pro because it has many of its same features. It still has that beautiful 27 inch 5K retina display and it also has a uh, graphics card which that is really good and plus it's basically half the price. It comes in at $2,300. It's still expensive but the iMac Pro is $5,000, so you are saving a little bit of cash there. Although I am not an Android fan or Google fan at all, what I do uh, want to quickly take a look at is the brand new Google Pixel Book. Now, this is a Chromebook, which comes in at $900. So this is not a cheap Chromebook compared to some that are basically $100. But what I want to quickly take a look at is this design. As you can see, it, very, it looks very similar to the Google Pixel phone, as it is both metal and glass. Now, I open it up, as you can see, it almost looks like a, um, a nice brick of material. It is a very nice design. Keyboard feels great, and I do like the trackpad. But if you are looking for a Google device that has a pen and you can do some fairly pro work on it, this is definitely the machine for you. Hey Siri, tell me a joke. I can't. I always forget the punchline. Hey Siri, what is today's date? It's Friday, February 23rd. All right, so as you just saw there, here is the brand new Apple HomePod. Now, this costs $350, so pretty expensive smart speaker if you ask me, compared to the Google Home Mini, which is about $30 to $50, bucks depending, uh, depending on where you buy it. But it is that price for a reason. This thing can give you some great bass in your music. It is very helpful, and it has technology to sense what type of environment it is in. So depending on if it's in a big room or a very compact room, it will just have far the sound travels so you can get an even and equal sound depending on where you are in this 360 degree speaker so this is definitely really cool and as you can see here are some commands that you can ask so hey siri uh, play party music hey siri play lord's first album hey siri dj for me hey siri play 90s hip-hop has a lot of music commands and you can also ask questions like hey siri do i need an umbrella today now um we have the space gray model um right here but you can also get the white which I think it looks better in person than it does on the picture. So anyway, this is a pretty cool piece of technology. We're just on the way home now. I definitely saw a lot more in the store than I thought I would get to. By the way, guys, let me know down in the comment section below if you want to see these tech vlogs become more of a series because I definitely think it will be interesting to go to a different store in every single video and see what type of tech I can find. But anyway, guys, that is going to be it for today's video. So thank you guys so much for this video. Hope you enjoyed. And I, yeah, guys, until next time, we'll see you later. A goodbye. Bye.